Alright. It's been a while and we are back. <sighs> Planet is getting hostile. That is not good. Alright, we're gonna have our explorer heal up. Ah, oh, we got a new virtue. Excellent. I don't have to worry too much about maintenance. <laughs> Alright, and last time... Yes. Move out. Hmm. There's a lot of land with a lot of potential. Hmm. But we're gonna have to clear out that mama if we can clear out that mamaza or somehow gain immunity to it. That would really help out. Ooh, what can we make? Hmm. Let's get that nursery. All planets. Excellent. Hmm. Get our power systems up and running. All right, get those aliens out of our outposts. Wipe those fuckers out. Oh, looks like they're running after them. They want to fight. They get a fight. Ugh. Look at all those aliens. This planet really wants us dead. Hmm. Hello? An ancient tomb? Hmm. What's in Mamaza? We're gonna have to deal with that soon. But hey, another, another group of aliens dead. All right. Ooh, more research. Hmm. All units get plus five healing, and alien preserves give us plus one science and energy. I say we study the weaknesses. If we can study how best to kill them, we won't have, to, we won't have too many troubles. And there goes another nest. Popping the zits off this planet. The five mythical creatures of Earth are the dragon, the unicorn, the griffin, the llama, and the chimera. The llama? The llama? Um. Okay, I'm breaking character for this, but. Okay, dragon, unicorn, griffin, chimera, sure. Llama? I'm. I'm confused. I'm confused. Okay, back in character. Excellent. We have created the gene vault. It'll increase our growth, give us food, and even and a little extra happiness. And then build the pharmaceutical labs. Hmm. We're gonna want to build some more 
outposts, but this time in closer areas. Hmm. Perhaps if we build one right here, we can get access to that floatstone and copper. Yes. We should. Alright, Marines. Time for a bug hunt! Keep them off our borders. Hmm. Oh. My. God. What the hell was that? The, the first five machines of Earth are... The wheel. The lever. The inclined plane. The dynamo. And the screw. No comment. Right. Let's work on the defense grid. Alright, Marines, get the hell out of there. Fortify your defenses. I think we may have picked a bad fight. You know, I'm just pointing that out there. Alright, start patrolling this area and hopefully we find some. Hmm. Find some nests to take out. Oh, a pod. Huh. New place has been founded. Let's see, Shackleton. I don't see anything. Hmm. Oh, oh, it meant my place. Ugh. Man, I'm stupid. <laughs> Friends log. Apparently, I am stupid. All right, let's get to work on making a old earth relic. Oh. All right, a solar collector. Fire. Excellent. Don't see why we can't go up that way, but, well, it'll keep supporting us. <coughs> Ugh, great, another Thanks. nest. <sighs> Things are so aggressive. Approaching in our territory. All right, fire. Okay, I think we're going to need an ultrasonic fence there. Just getting that feeling.
Hold them back. Alright. Hmm? Ah, a new mesh unit. Hmm. I think we should add a plus one production to our city for our city production. That should help us a little better in the long run, because it supports everything. Stay alert. I don't think the worm sees you. Oh, we sees him. That is horrifying. Hmm. Stay on the defense. by these guys <laughs> but his friends ain't gonna help him ah another resource pod always helpful again another one we are doing very well at the moment. I think now we can work on another... Another pod. Another colony. Yes, if we build in this area, we'll have access to numerous resources. And... It'll bring us closer to home. Actually, we should probably try building... Hmm. All right. I don't think it's something. Stay fortified. And we get a little more energy. Excellent. What the hell is that? Whatever it is, it doesn't look friendly. And that is clearly not friendly. At least we're holding it back. Okay. Send in military units to uncover the tomb. All right. Works to me. Now then, what do we want? Yeah, we're probably going to want to do that. All right, explore, get out of there. Okay. 
Alright, another nest taken out. The explorer units certainly do help. With, with nests bursting. Alright, we'll send the military in to check it out. Hmm. Excellent. Okay. Fortify until you're healed. Then you can continue exploring. And hopefully finding some good land for us to settle on. Something we need. Good areas to control. Okay. Build that. Alright, and... Thinking on where to put our next colony... I'm thinking we'll move it a little closer to home. And then we'll move the next one here. We can probably start doing some trade routes with Lecor. If we can get a, a base close enough. Should help us both in the long run. Hmm. Let's get enhanced body functions. Oh. Oh, two resource pods. Lucky us. Well, I put a military unit here. What, do you want him to stay here? Le commerce fonctionne quand on comprend le Very well, then. I want... I sent a military unit in. What do you want? No matter, we'll start on computing. Well, after the sector geophysics, we can find some geothermals. That should help. A lot. More production. Central heating, and that's not friendly. That is definitely not friendly. Alright. New city. Oh, I didn't notice that crash pod there. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, there we go. Yes, homesteading this world is hard. Whoa. But all the people pitch in, and somehow the work gets done. I am alive, living in the time of the tomb's creators. You cannot imagine what power they hold, but perhaps in time you will know. Whoa. Whoa. So he went back in time. Yes, homesteading this world is hard. But all the... Wow. That's trippy. So we sent a guy back in time. Wow. That's that's pretty heavy, man. That's heavy. Uh, 
Alright. Okay, another satellite. Fire! Let's build a launch complex, and you will build a recycler. Yeah, we're looking good. Got all these farms. Yeah, we're turning Earth into our home. Earth it. Yeah, we're turning this into our planet now. <laughs> oh, I must have sounded a little crazy. Well, we started we started to augment some of our guys a bit. And I got one of the augmentations. Oh, sure, the side effect is... Eh. Eh. Sometimes I get a little screwy, but you know, I feel better. I feel good. What the hell is that? Okay, get out of the mamaza. Okay, start the computing. Oh. Whoa. Wow, we get. Wow, that's a pretty long trade route. Go for it. I didn't even think we can go that far. And yet, you can't. You can't just walk over to Shackleton. What's up with that? What is up with that? There's an old soldier's axiom. You can't kill what you can't see. The inverse is also true. That? That makes a lot of sense, actually. I honestly cannot argue with that logic. Okay. Get these guys off our lawn. Take out another nest. How we all looking, people? Good, everybody's happy. You're happy, I'm happy, and we just walked into that fight. Alright, get... Okay... I think you better fortify. Because I got a feeling these guys are not party worms. They are not Slurms McKenzie. No, they are not. And yes, I made reference to... 
to a dated show in 2000. From a show that it was in 2000. Zen. Hey, what you expect? What you expect? What year is it? What year is it right now? I don't even know. It just says turns. I don't even know what a turn is. For all I know, I just made a reference from 1,000 years ago. Thousands of years ago. When the off was young. Sorry, I'm now quoting the cybernetic ghost of Christmas past. Yeah, I've completely stopped doing the whole narrative thing. I think it was getting annoying anyway. Anywho. Let's add some more military might. Yes, we shall conquer all. Yeah, that was my plan. I'm going for... I'm going for either conquer everybody with supremacy or purify the hell out of us. So, yeah. Yeah. We're gonna have fun with that. But I'm not gonna have fun with the flyers. Those... Those guys are dicks. Hmm. Let's get started on that. And we have aliens. Oh, they aren't attacking my guys. Well, as long as they aren't attacking my guys, I guess I'm happy. But not these guys. These guys are on my lawn. Stay off my lawn! All right, you're on my lawn. You're on our lawn. We declare that all this land be ours. So you are technically on our lawn. <sighs> yeah, we're the we're technically the invaders. You know, these aliens are probably having a good time on their own, having fun with Sponge McKen Sp S with Slurm McKenzie, and then we showed up. We ruined the party. All right, go on a bug hunt. It's a bug hunt, man. Bug hunt. Except we're the hunters. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey, what are you doing on my lawn? You see what I do with the aliens? I'll do it to you, bitch. I do it to you, bitch. That's for you guys. I'm gonna go and attack you. Cause that's just how I roll. Now fire! <laughs> gotcha. And I bet those guys are gonna get eaten by by Worms McKenzie. And Slurms wants to kill us. We ain't drinking the product, so he wants to kill us. And oh my god, that does. You know, it just really makes me nervous. Fire! Yeah, I got a feeling these guys aren't gonna survive. You know, I just got that feeling. Oh well. You guys are a dime a dozen. Man, I'm mean. I'm mean. I, I am so evil. I should never run a nation. Ironically enough, I'm playing Kingmaker in D and D. <laughs> no, but seriously, I, I we are playing Kingmaker for Pathfinder. Well, this guy's fucked. Oh no! It's a bug hunt! It's a bug hunt! And holy shit, that guy survived? Give him a medal! Give him a medal of honor! Eh, 
No, seriously, look at that. This guy. Wow, that he is he is royally royally butt fucked. But you know, he will be remembered as Epico Badassico. That is what he shall now be known as, Epico Badassico. <laughs> wow, I am so terrible at this. See, this is why I'm better with other people. People can bounce off me. So at least when I sound stupid, you can always go with the idea that I intend to be, I'm acting like it, so that other people would sound smart. When I'm on my own and I sound stupid, yeah, I don't have that excuse. And you guys, you, you, you guys better run. Anyway, let's see how Epico Badassico is doing. Not very well. Nope! Ah. Poor, poor guy. Anyway, let's see what we got for a quest. Oh. Well, yeah, I was planning to trade with him anyway. See? Ooh. Really? Nice. Alright, I say now's a good time to call it quits. I do hope you enjoyed this episode. I really do. Anyway, let me know what you think about the series and all that. I never get a lot of... I don't get a lot of comments on my Let's Play videos. Really, I don't. I, I wouldn't even settle for, you suck, go die. I wouldn't even settle for that, because at least someone's commenting, you know? Anyway, bye.